stay here. But as the Danish manager said, I'm not sure whether I can trust some of my players. They might contrive the result. And here comes the chance for Sieverbeck. Manchester United, John Sieverbeck roaring through from the back. And on the target, just deflected by Furster. Soren Lerby. Laudrup. Anderson forsaking his marking role for the moment. Soren Lerby. Oh, great shot and a good save, but it was just as well Furster was there to pick up. And the Danes have obviously got the rhythm. Or perhaps did they not want to? But certainly Frank Arneson does here as he gets forward powerfully. And here's Laudrup. The flag is up for offside. It won't count. This protest from Arneson, that was a bit unfortunate. Laudrup was offside as that. But Olsen is robbed there rather naively. It's followed to Alofs. Alofs is in a good position here. Alofs, great save. And Bother hits the rebound first time over the bar. The Germans were in with a real chance there. The quick break. Klaus Alofs, terrific save by her. And the rebound flies wide. Looking for Herget. There's Berthold. He's in a good position. Oh, great save again. Well, Lars Herr started this campaign as the third choice goalkeeper. I think he's going to end up as the first choice. Ball by Heget. Good ball. Nicely picked up by Bremer. Rolf has gone for. Bremer can hit them. Oh, he hit the bar. What a shot from Andreas Bremer. Picked up by Berthold. Desperate bad luck by the West German fullback. And that flew through the high altitude there here. Bremer's shot. Goalkeeper didn't see it. Danes come again with Frank Arneson. Had a couple of bursts in the last few minutes. Arneson going very well. Arneson goes down. Surely that's in the area. Surely that's a penalty. Jakobs puts one forward to Rudy Voller. With Bruss. Rudy Voller. Put it back well for Matthews. Matthews going again. The goalkeeper saved Denmark yet again, but he was a bit fortunate when Matthews' shot came out again. And it was flicked just wide. Olsen. Olsen still coming. Orton Olsen driving into the air. He goes down. The Danish captain's run from the back has earned them a penalty two minutes before the half-time break. 36-year-old legs, but he kept going pretty powerfully there. And the Belgian referee had no hesitancy in popping it onto the spot. And it looks as if it's going to be Jasper Olsen with the kick against Schumacher. Here's Olsen. So smooth. Manchester United, Jasper Olsen sends the Danish fans into ecstasy with a cool penalty just before the half-time break. Mateus helping him here. Jasper Olsen takes it away, but then loses it to Berthold, making a positive run forward. Berthold still with it. Litbarski getting up. Does well! Litbarski from an impossible angle almost rolled one into the net goalkeeper was struggling here the first time hers made a mistake but Klaus Alaps on his left is Bremer room now for Hegel oh a lot of room now 
for Mateus. Mateus denied by brilliant goalkeeping by Lars Hur. Round in midfield. Surely there's going to be more goals here. Here comes Jan Molby. On the right is Frank Arneson, and they're wide open with Ericsson getting in the middle. John Ericsson, the second for Denmark. Well, Arneson did the spade work. Ericsson, the substitute, pokes it in. But such wide open spaces for the Danes to exploit. Of course, the Germans were down to 10 men at this stage. There's no firster, but there's no cover either. From Anderson here. Anderson dashing forward. Anderson might go for one himself. Looking for the quick return from Ericsson. Ericsson shoots. Just wide. He's enjoying this taste of first team football. The Feyenoord leading scorer. That wasn't so far past the post. Being told having a backtrack. In for Lipowski. Nice little dodge. Good shot. Oh, that was cleverly done by Pierre Lipowski. Perfect control, dodging away from the tackle, and a pretty good shot. Edel. Forward to Rumeniga. Rumeniga, a great turn. And another good save by Lars Hur. Come out and close it all down so fast. Oh, there's problems here. Certainly dramas on the ground. Now, there's going to be trouble for Arneson because he's already had one yellow card. If he gets another yellow card, he's gone, and I'm afraid he is. How absolutely unnecessary. Apologies to Mateus. Totally unnecessary. Mateus and Arnison clash. There's a bit of stupidity there, but Mateus makes rather more of it than he should have done. And there's the final whistle. The referee involved in a little bit of controversy in a game which had been comfortably won by the Danes when he sends off Frank Arneson, but he really couldn't do any more. Lothar Matthaus, the Bayern Munich midfield player, well, might feel that he made rather too much of that, but in the end, a comfortable win in style for the Danes.